MYOB payroll employment payment transactions in previous videos in other courses within MYOB we've looked at sales modules and we've looked at the transaction journal and we'll see different sale transactions for the company if I go to purchases there's a transaction journal for purchases. If I click it, I'll start to see purchases for the company. It's the same with payroll. If I click payroll, I click transaction journal. It actually takes me to the same place, but to the most relevant tab. In other words, disbursements. Notice that we are still in the transaction journal and we can go to receipts, we can go to sales, purchases, general, etc. All from here. So I'm going to click back on disbursements. It's important also to note that disbursements include other payments that come from the company, not just payments for staff, as you can see here with Metropolitan Electricity, Telstra Bill, Real Estate Bill, etc. But it's where we go to find out our disbursements that we've made in wages to employees. And we can click on the little white arrow to get some more information about this particular transaction. We can see that the funds have left our check account. The payment method is electronic. The statement text shows us the payment period to break that down more specifically we can see the start and end date and the net pay and down the bottom here is a breakup of how we get the net pay the net pay here is a result of wage and salary minus superannuation payable PAYG and the superannuation guarantee so where we say superannuation payable here of course we mean salary sacrifice. So that's a transaction level coming from the transaction journal and we can go one step further we can print the transactions again. So notice the options here to preview the check and or to preview the payslip or to actually print either of those. So we can quickly click on one of these and notice here that the company information is there the names of the fields like annual salary and the dollar values are there so this particular form is designed to be printed on a white sheet of paper or what they call plain paper if we go to information like preview the check for example you don't see any information about Clearwater except for when you scroll down but this is more uh, detailed information. Normally the check would be pre-printed. So just that's a little bit of a, an intro unless you've done the setup and you you'll understand about how forms are created but this is designed to be printed on a pre-printed or stationary form. And that's information about payroll payment transactions.